advantage of the opportunity. Are you... Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master! Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally missed yourself. Josh! What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Hello, Earth to Matt. You gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. Madam? Why, thank you, sir. Hey, ma'am? Yeah? I think we should start the weekend over. Right now. Clean slate. Oh? No arguing. No mic, no Jess, just you and me enjoying ourselves and all this nature. Oh, you mean oh natural? Damn straight. I can get with that. Doofus, come this way. You, uh, trying to get me somewhere private? Why don't you, uh, come find out? Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. It's no problem, babe. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. You gonna back that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. 
Wait, what does that mean? Like, all day long, I was being, like, sexy. here tonight. Wow. Yeah. It's so nice to be here with you, muscle man. Uh, I'm not all muscle. <laughs> there are some brains in here too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this all for us. Like a gentleman. Well, come on. Let's look around. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off anyways. Maybe I wanna show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. Sexy kisser on this thing. Dare to put your hand in it. Day, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. Ah! <gasps> Emily! Emily! <laughs> gotcha, big dip. Jesus, you're ridiculous. Oh, come on. What was that? A we're not sure. Probably just an animal. Do not like. Madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agree.
I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? How do you feel about people who are afraid? <laughs> I see, well, Mike has a fear of isolation. Do you feel pity for him? Well, this is not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What do you value? What do you respect in yourself and others? Which would you say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? So, you would tell the truth even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then, and charity? Such a giving and caring person. Very nice. Oh, well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness... Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Oh, watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Jess? <coughs> Jess! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since... You're a recent convert. Why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. How can we help you? 
<laughs> it's moving again. Whoa. What's it spelling? <laughs> War. It's moving fast. Warning. Shit. Oh my god. Warning? I think we uh, really need to find out who's trying to communicate with us. We can't help you if we don't know who you are. Can you tell us who you are? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Whose sister? Oh, come on, is this for real? Shut up. Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Are we speaking to Beth? Is that you? Oh God! <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No, dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If if this is actually Beth, I mean. We can find out what happened that night. Oh, okay. Um, let me think. Beth, we want to know what happened to you that night. Can you tell us? H A N N. It's spelling Hannah. Wait, it's still going. K I L. Oh, oh my god. Killed. Guys, guys, what's she talking about? I don't know if I can keep doing this. We have to. Just, just, just stay calm. I, I think it's saying that someone killed Hannah. I don't know. I just a ask it something else. All right. Okay. Who killed Hannah? Who was it? L, I, B. The library. Maybe there's something in the library here. E, R, O, O. Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library. Oh, no. oh. <laughs> Holy shit, Chris. You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, look, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need this right now, okay? You guys are full of it! Sh should we go after him? Ah, oh, man, I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if, you were faking it if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Jessica, oh come on, Jess, buddy, you in there? <laughs> ah! Whoa, Christ! <sighs> Scared blue out of my jeans. <laughs> the hell is that doing in there anyway? Yes. Where did you go? This is not funny. I totally oh! Oh my God. No. <laughs> that was so good. Not, no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You had to see those. Had to I'm not see seeing it. No. 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 <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face. <laughs> I was.
just scared, Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry, don't I'm, scare you. If we send that to anybody, <gasps> I'm what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady-like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. <laughs> As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind-melting thrill skills. Michael. Wait, what? It's heaven. I love it. Yeah. play, my good lady. I just scared you. I didn't soak you. Hey, I will do everything in my power to warm you up. You better get cooking. Do not underestimate my culinary chops. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, bud. Oh hey, buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Ah! Ah! Run! Run! Oh my god, what the hell was that? I don't know! Oh, there's a friend! Over here, over here! Mike! Get over here! Barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay. Well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. <laughs> 